Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy, it's Frolix here, bringing you another video on the channel. In today's video, guys, I am going to be telling you how you guys can buy a nightclub in GTA 5 online. And um, yeah, I'm going to be showing you guys around in the nightclub in another video, possibly. Um, but I'm going to be telling you guys a few things you need to know before you buy the nightclub and some stuff like that. So hopefully you guys enjoy the video. And um, yeah, let's get straight into things. So first thing that you guys are going to want to do, of course, is go ahead and load into GTA 5 online after you've updated the game. Um, and you're gonna wanna go to the Maze Bank foreclosure site. And when you go onto the screen, the first thing you're gonna see is clubhouses and the, like all of this other crap. So just go ahead and click nightclubs here and it'll just show you this main nightclubs. So the one that I purchased was the most expensive one and I fully modded it out um, for $5 million. Now, when you want it to buy in the nightclub by itself, this one is 1.7 million and everything ranges in price. Um, like there's some expensive ones, there's some cheap ones, like it goes all the way down here and they're only like a million bucks, so let's go to my expensive one here. So let's say I wanted to renovate it, you would go ahead and find the nightclub style that you want. So obviously you would want to pick this one, this looks really cool, but you would think it would be set up and ready for you. But when you first buy the nightclub, it looks exactly like this and you actually need to find a team of people to help you go ahead and get these supplies so you can make your nightclub look dope. So it's it's gonna take a little bit of work to get all of this stuff. Um, so you, of course you guys have to put in the work. It's probably not gonna be that hard, but you're gonna need to get that. Um, for the light rig, you guys can put this cool stuff on the ceiling. I think that's really sick. Um, I like this one a lot. And of course they all cost extra and I put the maximum, the best one that you can get. I think it was like 250K or something like that, but I put this one on. The nightclub name, I don't, Okay, no, they're all the same price. I put on Tony's Funhouse, just because, you know, hey, Tony's back. Um, yeah, so you guys can put all this, that stuff on. Now, this is what I really like. You guys can have up to four extra floors to your storage facility. Four. And it costs a lot of money. Like, a lot. I can't show you guys the prices again, because it's not letting me, but um, just for that, I think it was $2 million for and, um, and for the garages. 2 point something million extra added onto the price of this. So it's pretty freaking crazy. Um, so yeah, I've also bought four floors for garages. So I'm gonna be able to store 40 vehicles in here and I'm gonna have four floors in my storage facility. That's a lot, which can hold a lot of stuff. And then you guys get dancers. And of course, if you want the most expensive ones, you gotta get the style three dancers. There's also style two and one. Um, and you don't have to just get girls, you can get two guys or a, bi a guy and a girl. Um, and yeah, and you guys can also, also purchase dry ice, which is just gives some more like a smoky theme, and then you click purchase. Then once you've done that, you come over here and you have to go through a really long animation video, and you're gonna notice your nightclub has nothing in it. So what you're gonna have to do is go to this computer in your office. So as you guys can see, I just up, went up here. So it says this is your private office. Tony has already started renovating this area and shares this space with you. So at least it's a little bit renovated. It's not ultra renovated, but it's got in there. Okay. All right, so it looks like workout in the warehouse and garage, it's nightclub level below, all that kind of crap is being done too. Log on to the computer to access the nightclub management app and begin the setup for the rest of your club. So that's what you guys need to do to actually get everything that you ordered and get everything ready to go pretty much. So I guess that's Tony's desk and we're just gonna go ahead and sit over here. So, okay, yeah, of course you have to register. Um, did I already register? Register as a VIP. Oh. There, okay, let's sit down, let's do this, boys. Okay, so like I said, you wanna do this, all right, so you guys can pick which one you wanna set up first. So should we set up the staff or the equipment? Um, I think we should set up the staff first because you're gonna want more staff to help you set up the equipment, of course, so of course you're gonna wanna get some staff, so you click it. Um, I'm honestly not too sure what happens here because this is the first time I've done this and I'm just, I'm going through it just like you guys would be. All right. I'm not actually, of course, gonna do the mission or whatever in this video, because it would take too long, but I'm just showing you guys exactly what you need to do. Okay, so apparently I have to collect, enter the vehicle. Oh, for a second I thought they gave me an McLaren. Nope, it's this. Oh God, there's gonna be, I don't have anyone else on my team, okay. 
Um, but anyways, guys, that's pretty much it for this video today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm going to be uploading a ton more videos in the next couple of hours on this DLC. And I hope you guys enjoy it. If you really do want to see more GTA 5 content, um, then be sure to subscribe. Or just comment down below saying you want to see more. Leave a like on the video. It's always greatly appreciated. And if you guys really want to see more, um, I might start live streaming on Twitch. And there's going to be more information about that later. But thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace.